and it's through the, the, the through the 31st. Oof. Should I say that three times fast? Through the 31st. Through the, through the, yep. Can't do it. <laughs> I know they'll probably be like, dang. What about now? Do I get a week yet? And also, fun fact about me, I don't turn on my heat or air. Now say what now? Everybody. My name is Andrea. If you're new here and if you are, feel free to hit the subscribe button down below. And to my OG subscribers, thanks for tuning back in and welcome back to another video. So today is not as formal as my normal videos. I wanted to do kind of vlog style because I'm pretty tired, if I'm being honest. Um, so I thought it'd be fun to actually get to restyling these bookshelves like I've been saying for months and kind of refresh my bedroom a little bit because you know summer is around the corner and I don't do a lot of seasonal decor but um, when the seasons change I kind of try to refresh my home a little bit you know with stuff I already have normally I bring you guys a haul I don't have a haul but I do have something new that I wanted to mention so like I said I'm refreshing my bedroom just a bit and it was the perfect time to get some new sheets from no other than Brooklyn out of the box Ooh. oh wow look how minimal and clean the packaging looks but you guys know in all my videos every week I bring you pieces that really really elevate your home without breaking the bank because I just don't believe that you have to spend an insane amount of money to have a beautiful aesthetic you just don't. And Brooklinen stands on that, okay? I know you guys have seen this all over social media, all over YouTube. So I'm so excited that they are sponsoring this portion of today's video. Thank you again. So usually when you buy your sheet sets, you get your fitted sheet, your flat sheet, and pillowcases. So essentially, you're already buying a bundle. When you bundle their products, instead of buying them individually, you save 25% off. And you know, we love that. But wait! There's more. On top of that 25% off you're already saving, they're having the Memorial Day sale, which is 20% off. Amazing. It's actually already started and it's through the, 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 through the 31st. Oof, should I say that three times fast? Through the 31st, through the, 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 the. yep. Can't do it. <laughs> if you catch this video after the sale, don't worry, I still got you. Hold on, I got a coupon for that. We have a promo code for $20 off any purchase over $100. And I will leave that in the description box as well. So I went with the Lux Hardcore Bundle, which, I mean, just the title, I was sold, okay? It has a 480 thread count. And oh my gosh, y'all, I can already tell this is going to be perfect for summer, even year round. Right now, I have linen sheets on my bed. And you guys know I made the switch because I'm a hot sleeper. And I love them, but it's time to give them a break. Like, if they could talk, I know they'll probably be like, dang. What about now? Do I get a week yet? Because they never get a break, okay? <laughs> After they get washed, they get used. When I used to buy cheaper sheet sets, I used to have like five of them. So I would keep them in rotation. I would put one in the laundry and fold them up, put them up, use a different one on the bed. So essentially each set would only get used once a month. But then I elevated and once you have quality sheets, you cannot go back to the cheap ones. Like it's just not the same, sleep isn't the same, nothing is the same. And I am a person that really, I enjoy my bed, okay? If I'm home lounging, I'm on the couch or I'm in the bed, period. So this was the perfect time to get some new sheets and oh my gosh, these are so soft. Like I can't wait. And they're cool to the touch too, so I know like, I'm very weird, I'm a hot sleeper, but I get cold. And we have been having a lot of cold fronts where I live, so I literally still have a space heater on my side of the bed, just in case I get a little chilly. And also, fun fact about me, I don't turn on my heat or air. Now say what now? Because 
bills okay so like if it's reading under 67 i'll turn the heat on if it's higher than 74 i'll turn the air on but anywhere in between that you either take something off or put something on if your your body temperature needs to adjust okay because yeah so that's another reason why i don't mind investing in quality sheets because a lot of the time at home is spent in bed anyway so you want to be comfortable and like i said the thermostat here it usually is not touched okay so this is gonna help regulate my body temperature so excited so like I said I got the Lux hardcore bundle mainly because the threat count is 480 so I'm still gonna have that hotel soft life luxury experience so we have the pillowcases a new duvet cover which I honestly forgot this came with it because I have a linen one that needs a break as well. So that's perfect. And then of course we have the flat sheet and fitted sheet. Oh shoot. So I'll get two pillowcases in this and the hooked it up, okay? Yeah, hook it up. <laughs> they have so many different colors and patterns and I was tempted just slightly tempted to step outside the box and get something bold but it's something about white sheets like it just really gives me like i said the hotel feel you just can't go wrong it's classic it's timeless so i opted for the white okay so i'm gonna go ahead and throw these in the washer so we can get these on the bed asap and while we're waiting for them to get all clean and fresh we'll tackle these bookcases so i'll be right back Okay, so my stuff is in the washer, so if you hear something in the background, that's what that is. But I want to tackle my shelves. Like I said, um, I don't want to do too much. Um, honestly, when you look at like video now, you only see from here, here, on each side. So I'm mainly going to focus on that and just kind of switch some things around. So let's see what we can come up with so as a rule of thumb whenever you're redecorating it's usually a good idea to take everything off so you have a blank canvas and you're not trying to decorate around what you already have there so i'm gonna clear out this stuff yeah don't play with a don't be decided hey. still not understanding this logic hey i'm back and i'm better Want you bad as ever? Don't let me just let up. I wanna give you better, baby. It's whatever. Somebody gotta step up, girl. Somebody's on next up. Be damn if I let them catch up. It's easy to see that you're fed up. Okay, so like I said, I'm not gonna do too much. I'm mainly just focusing on what you guys see on my videos every week. So I think I'm just gonna keep the top shelves the same. I'll come back to that at a later date because I'm actually in a little, feel a little nap coming on. So yeah, some of the stuff is gonna be like the same stuff you see, just kind of arranged differently because I love them so much. Um, but I am gonna sprinkle a couple new pieces. I definitely want to use these wooden beads that I found a little while ago that I shared with you guys because it looks so good with my painting back here. And I also wanted to use this vase that used to be in my bedroom um, up here too because it pairs so well with this sculpture I found at Ross. Um, this is from Crate and Barrel, I do believe. I'll link it down below for you guys. And I can't link this because it's from Ross, but it was only $12 in case you missed that video. Run to your Ross. I haven't seen it since. I bought four of them <laughs> um, because I knew they were just not going to come around again. So hopefully you guys can still find it. And yeah. Uh, I am on a whole nother level. Belly only fought you over cause you let him. Fucking girl, I guess you didn't know any better. Girl, that man didn't show any effort. Do all I can just to show you it's special. Certain it's your love that holds me together. Lately, you say he been killing the vibe. Gotta be sick of this guy. Pull up skirt, get in the right. Left hand is steering, the other is gripping your thigh. Light up a spiff and get high. Shout it, yo. What you been missing? Looking at you, I'm thinking he must be tripping. Play this song for him, girl, I'm just with him. Girl, said he keeps on playing games and his loving ain't the same. I don't know what to say, but what a shame. If you were mine, you would not get the 
same If you were mine, you would top everything Suicide in the box with your legs And a thing so far, baby, no propane Got good pussy, girl, can I be framed? Keep it 100, girl, I ain't no saint But he the only reason that I'm feeling this way Giving you the word, baby, when you get space pen gang Give me lay, baby, that's penetrate Oh, baby Hey, Sean, now you niggas on the throw Come on, party some more Yeah, got the drink in my baby. cup Got a young nigga feeling so throw Spit fire in the world so cold Young money got a nigga feeling low Spit fire in the world so cold Okay, so we are done for now. Like I said, most of the stuff you guys have seen already. Um, but until I finish my bookcases in my living room, I just want to be able to see my favorite things in here. So, yeah, I just kept that dough ball up there because, like I said, you never see it. And then right here, I put my lovely sculpture from Ross that I still can't believe I found um these books y'all if y'all can get your hands on this architectural antiques book it was so hard for me to find um i think it's like discontinued or something but legit one of my favorite books like amazing i just have this candle up here that i burn sometimes while i'm in here because i don't want to burn the place down <laughs> i don't even think i don't think it's safe to burn candles in a bookcase but it's only when I'm sitting in here because it just looks so good so yeah I just have that on this Viola Marble um poster so these items you guys have seen plenty of times before I just love how they look together um this little lamp that I DIY'd only $12 on Amazon um I still haven't done a short for this <laughs> DIY so I'll try to get on that this week this book arranging things is amazing like nothing else to say just buy it still can't believe i found this book stand i've been stalking it ever since and it still hasn't come back in stock um but etsy does have a dupe that's a little bit more expensive that i told you guys about before i'll put it down below in the description box and then of course my beautiful viola calicutta round tray which I love I was kind of going back and forth on this shelf right here because like I love this bowl but I didn't want to put anything too busy with it because this shelf right here is busy enough so I just ended up with this book it's actually called timeless living It's by Wim Powell's I believe I just took the cover off because there's literally nothing under there so yeah that is this side of the room and then of course we come over here i left the top shelf like it was um just that wabi vase that versace book that's a selenite log right there in the middle and just like i think that's like petrified wood or something on the stand i just thought it was, was really cute and then i moved this bowl to this side with these wooden beads that come out of it because i just feel like they pair so well with my painting so good and then here we have my little vase from Crate and Barrel. That sculpture up there is from H&M Home. And I haven't seen it since. They haven't brought it back. So hopefully they do because it's such a good one. This book, I don't think I've ever shared it with you guys like in a haul or anything, but I just love the way it looked. Louis Vuitton manufacturers. And then down here we have the bowl that was on the other side because I just love the shape. Rural Retreats book, another fave. And of course, another Viola Marble piece because I'm just that obsessed. Case in point, <laughs> it's sprinkled everywhere in here. Um, and you guys saw this side table in my, was it my last video? Yeah, it was my last video. Fits so well right here. And I just put this piece right here as a little poster. So yeah, now that we are done in here, let's go to the bedroom.
Before we go, I need to mention this that I found in Marshalls. It was only $19.99. You can also find this on Amazon. I'll link it down below. It's $25 on Amazon. And then on TJMaxx.com, it's $16.99. So y'all know I'm cheap. So um, I'm going to be returning this and ordering the one on TJ Maxx to save some more dollars and order some more. But if you like Santal, y'all, amazing like we're gonna spray these on my sheets when i make up the bed to really give that hotel experience so excited about it and you can also i mean this is a perfume but i'm gonna use it in the house too as a room spray so yeah so let me explain <laughs> so i went to go get my bed linens out of the dryer came in here put them on the bed sprayed that santal perfume and i was like okay let me just take a little 10 minute break before i have to continue filming i put on sale and sunset and fell asleep. <laughs> I told y'all I was tired. Um, I only got it because my phone went off. But that's actually a good thing because I can testify to these sheets. They were soft when I opened the packaging, but after I washed and dried them, even better, even softer. So yeah, and this is the hottest part of the day. At this point, it's like almost 3.30. <laughs> so it's the hottest part of the day and I wasn't sweating, so chef's kiss so i'm gonna go ahead and put on the duvet cover i'm actually excited about the pillowcases too because i'm gonna keep my satin ones on here because that's good for your skin and hair and stuff but for the ones that i you know put on the bed every day y'all know i had those brown linen ones that i love i love the color but it shed so much like i don't know if y'all can see it um i'll have to wash those a few times for it to stop doing that but I'm, I'm just so over the mess. So I'm really happy I got those new pillowcases. Um, so yeah, let's finish making up the bed. I just wanted to get a close up of how soft, like even wrinkled like that, cause I've been laying on them. Y'all, so soft, like no lie. I put my feelings on safety So I don't go shooting way I be Cause you take the bullet trying to save me Then I'm left to do what make you I do have to have my, I told you I sleep with my space heater <laughs> over here on the side because I get chilly throughout the night, but actually let me put that up really quick. Okay, that's a bit better, but this is the current situation of the bed. I'm gonna, don't worry, those nail polishes, clearly I do my nails <laughs> in bed as well. Um, I'm gonna get rid of that and do some decoration over here too, but the bedding. I have to steam this part, but I'm not even gonna bother right now because I'm definitely about to get back in the bed and finish binging Selling Sunset. I'm gonna pretty up the sides in just a second, but the bed, y'all, I'm obsessed. It's giving simple, but upscale. Don't forget to take advantage of the Memorial Day sale, 20% off until the 31st. And of course, if you miss it, I will leave the promo code down below so you can still get $20 off any $100 purchase. And thanks again, Brooklyn, and for sponsoring. Let's get into uh, the rest of the styling. Baby boy, your love got me trippin' on you You know your love is big enough, baby
So on this side, I just kind of threw this together. You guys have seen this vase, which is actually from Amazon. I just put that travertine spear right there to tie in my console table. And then those little faux florals. They're looking very, very burgundy on a camera, but they're actually this beautiful, like more fuchsia color. And I just love the way it looks with the brown, like so cute. Still can't get enough of these pillows, like, probably one of my best purchases i just love how yummy and rich the color is oh my gosh so good and it goes so well with this bedspread which i actually found on poshmark um it's a zara home throw but somebody was selling it on poshmark and it's just so perfect like the bedspread the pillows and then you get over here to my bench love that I kept it really simple on this side of the bed, just added a little tea light candle and a little marble um, coaster up under there with that room spray because y'all, I'm telling you, it smells so good. Get your hands on it. Sorry for the lighting. I closed the blinds because it's very backlit so you can barely see what's going on over here, but I love how it turned out. I was kind of struggling on what to put on the side table because I didn't want something too round that would interfere with the sphere pillow and then I didn't want anything too complicated that would um, take away from my little sculpture over here so so I just went with this vase I actually DIY this I have a whole video on it um, I'll link it down below I really think I did a good job with the color payoff love that and then just stuck these faux florals in here too I just thought it was perfect for spring summer no real flowers because I don't want anything that will die. <laughs> Ooh, this looks really good right here. Um, but I didn't want any real flowers because I don't want to have to replace them. Um, these do shed a bit, so yeah, those are from Home Goods though. Same sculpture up here. I just can't bring myself to take it down. It just looks so bomb. Perfect addition to the pedestal. And then the console table is pretty similar to what I had before. I just added this marble base right here that I got off Etsy. And then that little um, candle holder that I got from Zara Home. So yeah, kept it pretty simple. I didn't want too much going on. Um, like I said, I'm getting more items. So yeah, that will probably change in the near future. So I realized I forgot to do an outro, so here it is. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and spending some time with me. I hope you guys enjoyed sitting here, finishing up Selling Sunset, and resting up. So don't forget to like, comment, and share. Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you haven't. Take care of yourselves, those around you, and your mental health. And I will see you guys in my next video. But until then, peace out. <laughs>